Hey, what's up you guys? It's Annie back with another video helping you to turn your YouTube channel into a success. So for today's video, I am not filming the video I originally had planned to film today, but I had to make this video for more reasons than I can count. So overnight last night, I had a very loyal subscriber who basically messaged me the link to a video that she found on YouTube and asked if I would basically give my opinions on it, my feedback on it, do I agree, do I disagree, all of that. And watch this video gave me such a freaking headache. So because I love y'all, I'm gonna save you guys 20 minutes of your precious time and a headache and tell you that this guy basically spent 20 whole minutes saying that there is this new YouTube glitch that people have yet to discover where if you create a community tab post and or poll and flood the post with the most trending keywords on the face of YouTube, that post will just magically blow up and gain millions and millions of views and impressions and basically blow up your channel with it. Not only that, but he also claims that using this glitch on some of his community tab posts and polls are responsible for a very, very large amount of growth on his channel. And the really, really sad thing is, is that this guy has about 1.95 million subscribers. So a YouTuber who isn't seeing growth on YouTube and is looking for some kind of a secret or a glitch just like this is very likely to actually hear these baseless claims from this guy, believe that this is the landlocked secret to YouTube growth and blowing up on YouTube, do this very thing and expect the exact same results. And that is exactly what this guy is banking on. He thinks to himself, oh, I have 1.95 million subscribers. I could literally tell people that cows poop money and they would believe it, which angers me more than I can express. Because when people are desperately searching for answers, whether that is about how to grow on YouTube, how to lose weight or anything else they're trying to do or accomplish in their lives, they look to the experts or people who've been where they are now who have achieved the results and things they are looking for currently. So people like this guy who have a massive audience and a massive influence also have a massive responsibility and he chose to instead take advantage of that audience and that influence and use it for bad and negativity and spread these baseless claims in hopes that it will get him clicks and views and growth. And unfortunately that is exactly what has happened. So let me save your time and your effort and your channel to tell you that number one, this glitch of his is not responsible for a large majority of his channel's growth. I promise you that if this guy shared with us an actual real screenshot of his traffic sources analytics, which I have talked so many times about on YouTube, I promise you the community tab would not be the number one traffic source on that list. Considering the topic of his channel, the amounts of views he has, the amounts of engagement he has, the optimization of his videos, the rank placements of his videos, this guy got his growth from search ranking the recommended page, suggested videos, and external traffic, which is basically everything every other YouTube channel that has ever blown up on YouTube uses on a day-to-day -day basis. So his channel is basically gaining the organic growth that everybody and their mother on YouTube preaches you to get. But rather than being upfront and honest about that, he sees a bigger, better opportunity for more views and more growth and figures, let me lie to people and spread this random glitch that doesn't exist in hopes that it gets me more clicks and views from people who want to learn how to grow on YouTube. Secondly, and this one really, really turned my head. His claim of the algorithm factors made my head spin. He says that the algorithm predominantly looks at titles, tags, description, and topic. Our friends over at Little Monster Media Co. basically made a 40 second short video that essentially expressed every single thought I had in my mind as I watched this part of his video. Those are not the main factors that the algorithm is looking at on YouTube and most certainly not in that order. As has been explained by myself, a multitude of other channels and YouTube themselves, the algorithm looks to serve every single viewer on YouTube the perfect video they are most likely to want to watch and to keep viewers on YouTube for as long as possible. Therefore, the YouTube algorithm is predominantly looking at the keywords and metadata of every single video on the face of YouTube to serve videos relevant to every single viewer and also looks at every single video's video length, average view duration, and audience retention to serve out videos that tend to hook people and keep them on YouTube for longer. But if all I'm saying is true, then how did this guy get over 1.2 million views on his video? First of all, it is optimized around and ranked in search for a multitude of keywords surrounding the YouTube algorithm, how to grow on YouTube, YouTube growth, getting views. So if anybody searches up on YouTube, YouTube algorithm, YouTube glitch, YouTube growth, his video comes up as a search result and gets views that way. 
and also because if his video is optimized around these keywords to rank in search, that means his metadata is also optimized, meaning all these keywords are in his titles, description, and tags, as you can see on his channel, meaning YouTube is going to find viewers on YouTube who typically search for and watch videos about YouTube growth and the algorithm and serve those viewers this video because it's relevant to content that you usually like to watch on YouTube. So this video and every single other video on his channel is blowing up not because of this glitch he is trying to spread across YouTube, but it is blowing up for the exact same reason every single other video that has ever blown up on YouTube has before. But what made me really, really, really suspicious of this guy and his channel and this video? Check out the comment section of his video and the comment section of the community tab post he is mentioning in this video. There are over 59,000 comments on this video. Video, the majority of which is the exact same comment that has been copy pasted by thousands among thousands of people over and over and over again. And oh, the exact same comment copy pasted over and over and over again on the community tab post he referenced. That my friend is suspicious. Now allow me a minute or two to tell you how doing exactly what this guy mentions and suggests in his video could severely hurt your channel. This guy's suggestion is essentially to find any and all keywords currently trending on YouTube and copy copy paste them on literally any community tab post on your channel, whether or not it is relevant to these keywords. This is the exact same thing you see a lot of YouTubers do, where they will basically copy paste a little like cloud of keywords at the bottom of their description, full of like famous YouTubers names and other keywords and tags they assume will get them views on YouTube, whether or not these YouTubers have anything to do with their channel or their content. What YouTube sees this as is spam and misleading content, which if you are not already aware aware of is actually against YouTube's terms and services, very, very similar to the most extreme forms of clickbait, where you essentially use a thumbnail and or a title and tags and description that has absolutely nothing to do with your actual video's content, just in the name of getting clicks and views. I've actually had more than five members in my Facebook group this month posting about being rejected for monetization on their channels because YouTube flagged their content on their channel as misleading content. Because as I just said, their content content is misleading, which is against YouTube's terms of service. So please, please, please disregard every single word this guy said in his video. Actually go ahead and report his video as misleading because that is exactly what it is. If you want to grow your YouTube channel, do it properly. Grow an organic audience that is actually genuinely interested in your content that will stick around and watch more of your videos. This will get you so much further in YouTube growth. This will make you so much more money when you are monetized on YouTube. This will gain you more trust in advertisers and potential sponsors and will keep you free of the YouTube police and happily existing on YouTube. So that you guys is it for this video and my very very lengthy rant. If you guys are still watching to this point, I love you guys. Thank you so much. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, found it insightful and or helpful. Thank you all so much for watching. Love you all to the moon and back and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!